In this video, I'm going to show you uh, specifically just how to handle the input routing for Logic Pro. Now let's go ahead and drag this up so I can see the entire channel strip. And you'll notice that the input section is right here. Uh, once again, just a reminder, this is being recorded in my studio in Cleolum, so these inputs available here are different than what you'll see there. However, inputs 39 and 40 and 40 blah 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 down there in, at central, you'll see HV3D 1 and 2 for the Millennium Media Channel 1 and 2, HV3D 3 and 4, and that's where you would select the inputs. Notice how its inputs uh, have two numbers, 43 and 44. That's well, one clue that we're in stereo mode. See this little icon here? That is the channel mode. If I click it, now I'm in mono mode. Two circles, stereo mode. Notice the meter down below. It's a little fat when you're in stereo mode because it shows you left and right. Click it again, it changes to a single mode. Okay, so that is how you select inputs, your, your input routing in Logic Pro. Thanks for watching.